I don't know what happened there, but I don't know how I feel about this card in this deck. Um, yeah, I'll just have to keep playing with it. See how I like it. It's not bad, but I don't know if there's something better I should be playing. And then three evenly matches. Um, say you go first, you know, your opponent sets up a, a crazy board. You play your, uh, your Lilith. You evenly matched. You have no cards unfilled because you sacrifice your Lilith. And it's... Oh, wait a second. Never mind. <laughs> I, I didn't use this because I forgot Lilith sets. It doesn't uh, add to your hand. So evenly matches are probably not the best in here. But they help you if you go second because... Um, uh, yeah, it's hard for us to stop big old boards. So stuff like evenly matched helps. It is so searchable too. Um, sanctums. Just to special summon your scythe. You got red eyes fusion. You got uh, now into the spells. You got your red eyes fusion. You know your terraforming to get you into your layer of darknesses. And layer of darkness. This turns every monster on the field dark. And if I were to tribute my monsters, I could tribute my opponents instead. Um. Three super polymerizations with all my opponents' monsters being darks because of layer of darkness. Um, you could do you get wipe their whole board, you know, some good stuff. And then three pot of extravagances. These would be that new pot pot of whatever that one's called. There's too many. The one that you banish, uh, or excavate the top six of your cards. Pick one and put the others in any order in the bottom of the deck. So that's kind of what this deck is right here. That's what I'll be playing instead of this. But this works too. It's not too bad. Of course, you want to try to use your Dragoons and your Dragoon play first before you play that. Um, yeah. And then we go into the extra deck. So the extra decks, of course, we got the one Dragoons. Right. We have um, got the one Mud Dragon. Of course, because you play the, the Palmerization. Two monsters with the same attribute for different types. Um, you play one pet plant, or no, yeah, one pet plant. Um, whatever this card's guy card is called, Dragus Tapilia. And you play one of him. Well, I play one of him. He uh, goes in one fusion monster, one dark monster. Then I play two of this guy. This guy is great. Three dark monsters. So your opponent just has with the layer of darkness out on the field. You got Super Poly. Uh, your opponent has an unbreakable board. Super Poly, bring this guy out. He also is a, he negates a special summon from the extra deck uh, and destroys it. So he he's just good, really good in the deck. Um, then of course three Nentis because uh, yeah you play the punishments. Then you got your three Starving Venom Dragons, which is self-explanatory. You know what he does is good. You got your just in case, you know, you got your Travelers of the, you got Dante, Traveler of the Burning Abyss. Like I said, if you need a, just a big guy out there, sometimes you good to go into him, maybe help push for game. Um, and then you got your um, Beat Cop. Um, nothing too crazy, just if you need Sangin off the board, uh, it's an easy link to get off or something. Yeah, I, haven't, I don't really use her, she's just in there. But let me show you guys this combo. So... I mean, it's not too special, but it's a cool play, you know. You uh, tour guide, tour guide into Sangan. Then you uh, link those guys to go. Oh, sorry. Before we do that, I played one Verte and Akonda, but I had to use it. This was the Verte or Akonda. So you link going to Verte, right? Um, Verte effect. Actually, we'll do a Sangan's effect. Sangan will add me uh, either Ash. Or if I want a, a set up play for next turn, if I don't have a Lilith, I have Ash for, for more like uh, distru disruptions on my turn. Or a Ghost Bell. So we'll add either or. Ash is the more, more common one. Um, yeah, go into Verte. Verte Sands. Um, Verte Sands. Um, Red Eyes Fusion, 
to special summon or to sand to do do sorry to sand him and him to get cheer oh my goodness what am i doing it's late to get your um, dragoons right so that's a that's a play right there that you can do uh you know you got your search f sangin so this was just off one card this is just off of uh um tour guide right so one card got me dragoons on field and uh ass blossom in hand and then also got me if i have my um levier in hand has my three darks so i can bring out levin air if i need to so yeah that's a that's a combo you know there's 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 some other cool stuff you could do in here how i feel how the deck performed wasn't too bad uh i played against modolches i played against um what was the other deck jeez i can't think right now guys but uh yeah um it needs it needs one more thing to make it that much better uh it's all right now it's kind of it, it's frustrating to play with your opponent one of the winning conditions of course is is a, a sanctum and and yeah setting sanctum um yeah that's the deck there you guys let me know what you think uh like comment and subscribe hit that notification bell i don't normally post have it in forever but i'm gonna try to start posting again so um yeah let me know what you think guys thank you have a good day